I just love landscape. And I love landscape that hasn't been manipulated. And it's, it was really almost overpowering. I mean, you've seen the, a, a royal palm here, the whole mountainside be royal palm, not three here and five here. You know, here you have to plant the trees in odd numbers. I can tell if a forest has been manipulated by man. Some of them have been because the Russians cut a lot of stuff down, but uh, it was very natural. World-renowned photographer Clyde Butcher has a sampling of work called Cuba, the natural beauty that's on display at the Marco Island Historical Museum. When asked about that 2002 excursion, Butcher said it allowed him to photographically graze over the entire island. This trip came after the United Nations declared 2002 as the year of the mountains, and the ambassador to Cuba invited Butcher to photograph the island's mountains. The first trip, um, we did the eastern part. The second trip, we did the middle. And the last part, we did the west. The places he, his wife Nikki, and Cuban guides hiked stood out to Butcher so much so that he, at times, felt like he was in another world. One wet and rainy day, they set out on a specific hike, where they were going to be taken to the area where Castro had his secret rebel camp. This trek was one to remember. We got halfway there to this, where his camp was, and the guy says, well, you realize you can't take pictures. <laughs> okay, let's just turn around and go back. People are going to come see your exhibit. What's the one thing you hope they come away with? Smile, seeing Cuba as a natural, beautiful place. It's, the whole world is a beautiful place, but it's in dire danger now. And Cuba is one of the few places that's not in dire danger. Will you go back to Cuba at some point? No, probably not. I'm not physically able to do it, I don't think. I take my walker where no man has taken the walker before. I've had the walker up to water this high. So it gets me out there. It's really been a, a savior for me mentally, getting out there and, and doing my work. I mean, I think since my stroke, I may have photographed more than before. The stroke Butcher suffered in 2017 hasn't kept him out of the swamps and landscape areas he's known to frequent in southwest Florida. And his followers still ask him for photography advice. People ask me the question, well, how do I photograph? I say, it's very simple. Just see where you want to go in a picture and point your camera there. Cuba, the natural beauty, will be at the Marco Island Historical Museum through April 29th, 2023. For WGCU News, I'm photojournalist Andrea Melendez with managing editor Michael Braun.